Hi everyone, welcome to Straight for the Divine Tarot. We're Monday, March 25th, 2024. <clears throat> and I'm here to do a collective read for you. Thank you, thank you, thank you for being here. I'll save the spiel for today. As you know, you know, you know the, I don't use the signs and genders and it's a timeless read. So don't make things fit. If it does, it's not advisable. Um, only take what applies. Leave the rest, please. Okay, it's not personal. It's not personal reading. Uh, thank you for being here, by the way. I love you guys. Thank you for liking and subscribing for the new ones that have been here, that are here. Uh, thank you for the ones who've been here for a while and supported me throughout. Um, I'm truly grateful. Thank you. Thank you for your super thanks. I, I don't want to forget saying that. I'm truly grateful. Thank you very much and your donations. Um, showing me a great deal of love. Sometimes it's a thankless job. Some people just don't appreciate it. You know what I mean? You see it in the comment section, but... Oh, well, you know, you can't please everybody. And if they don't like you, they can just move on. I don't get why they stick around. And not only just, like, for one reading. They'll be, they'll comment on a reading. And then five later, five hours later, they'll come back and comment again. And then another three hours later, they'll comment again. Why are you hanging around? Obviously, you're hanging around for nefarious reasons, if you keep doing that, right? You know, we're not all as smart as you. You can figure it out. You're smarter. <laughs> Oh, I don't know. God, this is where we're going with this. But thanks for being here, everybody. Thanks for being a super fan. So, purification. Something needs to purify. I mean, it, this is wonky times here with energy. People are playing within lots of energy. So, you might want to purify, cleanse. I cannot pronounce this name. It's Pat Palotal. Sorry if I mispronounced it. That's the overarching energy. Bottom of the deck is control. Tiamat. So somebody might be trying to... Ooh, okay, I just got a... I, yeah, I just got something in my head right now. Somebody was playing with stuff that they shouldn't have been playing with and they're they're doing salt baths, purific purifications. They're trying to, you know, smudge, do the crystal, do whatever they can because they got themselves in trouble. They're trying to control whatever they, it is they summoned, possibly. Ew. They summoned chaos because if you know the story of Tiamat, yeah. That's not good. And they were after some prosperity. So they were trying to hurt your prosperity or try to bring in prosperity. They did something they shouldn't have done. Urzuli, you see the bags of jewels here, pearls. Pearls of wisdom. Maybe they didn't have any. I don't know. Or maybe they wanted your wisdom. Denial. Nuba. So they've been denied. Whatever spells they they cast at. Yeah. Coercion. Arishka girl. Somebody's been coerced to do some spell work and or... Yeah, they need a break. They don't want this. This was in uh, yesterday's. I, I shuffled this deck. Maeve. They want respite. Nyx is the goddess of night. So they didn't do their homework. Don't play with magic. That's all I got to say. Okay, even the ones who are well-versed and they've done it for ages, blah, 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 got away with whatever they did. They, they don't know everything either. There's different. There's so many different layers. You know what I mean? You don't know who's protecting whom. You don't know. Why? Um, I don't know why they got away with it for so long. Maybe it's just, you know, so they can harness it and give it all back in one fell swoop. I don't know. I, I can't answer for spirit and how they, they operate, but it's not a good thing. Even if you've been through do, doing it for years, you're going to get caught up eventually. So listen to friendly advice. There you go. This, this is uh, purification. Pay off your debts while you can. And that means karma as well. Take it on the chin, you know, take your lumps. An unexpected pregnancy is announced. Uh-oh. Don't put off going to the doctor. Your experiences will be called upon to help a friend. Take a walk on the ele on elevated ground, such as a moor or hillside. So, yeah. Go where you can maybe climb a hill or something. I don't know. Take it for what it is. You know your story. I don't. I can kind of guess, though. Tiamat. Here we go. Uh, you're more powerful than you think. Enforce some authority. If someone's trying to influence you, walk away from those who do not serve your highest interest. Reclaim your self-power. Investigate your past lives to heal fears of persecution. There you go. Maybe in the past life you've done spell work or you were accused of spell work and they persecuted you and you, you were innocent. It can be anything. We're still early on in this read. It can be any of those things. Why is purification here? It's papalotal. I'm picking up from the picture. Somebody's just like 
the look of it. They want people to think they're powerful and whatnot, but it's it's for looks. It's for inner. Um, I don't know. It's their image. I'm trying to control something though. They got themselves in a mess. Manipulation, energy manipulation, emotional, mental, verbal manip uh, manipulation here. Somebody has to operate with integrity. Maybe you do, or they're trying to coerce somebody to do some spell work, and they're going, no, 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 I'm not into it. Whatever this is. Yeah, they're after money, okay? It's all for gain. It could be your siblings involved. A lot of lies are involved. They're bullies. They're abusers. They, ca they cause a lot of pain, and maybe they get off on it. I don't know. They laugh at your pain. These people are fake, okay? Maybe somebody's saying, I'm in pain. Help me, help me. It's fake. Take it as, yeah, somebody's angry. Again, pain twice. So mm -hmm. they're going to be homeless, or they are homeless. This theft, or they wanted you homeless. Love bombing. Oh yes, yeah, this is inheritance. Maybe secrets, secret birth. They're in poor health. They need to see a doctor or a healthcare worker, or they are one, or they could be a healer. Or you can, okay? Somebody's beautiful. Pornography, smear campaign, devalue. So maybe because you're beautiful, they just automatically think you sleep around. They want people to, they and they, they're coming after you. They want you, people to think that you do pornography. It's a smear campaign. You know, they're doing magic, what I tell you. Because they're jealous. Death and endings. Because you're too spiritually high ranking. They got to settle this with spirit here. There's threat and force. Bribery. Relocate or move and neglect. And it's a cover up. You're too honest for these people. Okay? People see the honesty. It's in your face. It's in your voice. It's the way you live. It's the way you move. You can tell fake from phony. Well, I, I know I can. You know, not, not always, but sometimes there's good actors out there. But yeah, eventually they tell on themselves they can't keep up that manipulation for too long. I always look for patterns, right? If somebody's got a pattern that's not, or if something's not making sense. You know what I mean? Chances are it's because there's a lie in there. So, purification and manipulation. Oh, yeah, let's just do this magic. Don't worry, you're protected. Says who? <laughs> yeah, message. They're getting the message all right. They might want to manipulate you or they're manipulating else, someone else through messages. Oh, I just got flashed on somebody trying to be you, impersonating you, saying that they're trying to really make you look bad, Okay. It's the overarching energy with the message. I don't know if you, I, you saw that. Sorry, I just realized. Seven. So you could be traveling or moving. This could be also messages from authorities because that could be the authorities coming through. You're moving forward. You overcame quite a lot. Toil and labor. You worked hard on yourself. Or somebody's working hard with magic. But this is also 38 is 11. It's, it's justice. Okay. You have integrity. You're not going to be working like this. Somebody could be working for justice. It could be the police, authorities, Lawyers, judges, whatever. Somebody's trying to control. Somebody's remaining in control here. Yeah, something to do with your occupation. They want to control you, or, or control somebody else. Thirty-four seven moving forward. They, they could be trying to stop your work. It could be the reverse, right? You're an official person, though. Okay, you're on your possibly on your on, on your path and or your north node, or you're going to be dealing with the authorities. This is the chariot number seven coming for somebody was stopped by the authorities. You broke free. You saw through the illusions. Nine, you, you're you on your own here, Hermit. It's an investigation. You broke free from these people, or they want to break free. I don't know. Take supplies. They're hiding and cloaking a lot. There's a message of concern. So somebody's concerned. They need some healing. Oh, okay. Yeah. They're unstable. Maybe mentally unstable. Something's over, or they might be facing an ending here. Of a rich man. You could be dealing with a rich man. You could be this rich man. But there's change here. It's a, it's a transformation, transition. Maybe it has to do with that. Yeah, inheritance, life insurance. There's a main female here. Going to the courthouse. Child. This could be your child. You could be this child. This money could have been left to you. Somebody's traveling here. This could be your child that's traveling, coming towards you. Somebody's a gold digger and a cloud chaser. There's clue. There's clarity upon a situation here. They were doing something they shouldn't have done. And they were using magic to do so. Possibly on court officials. You know, like um, 
shut up spells and um, delay court spells and or you know manipulate a judge's energy so the judge doesn't see certain things or they're more um, amenable like they they'll they'll do what you want you know they'll whatever you suggest they'll do I don't know that's what I'm picking up it's not nice people here so we have purification it's papalotal message seven and manipulation so some some correspondence could have been manipulated to make it look like you corresponded with the courts and you didn't or somebody else was pretending to be you vultures wow depression anxiety worry that someone is against you they wanted you to feel like this or they're feeling like this okay they wanted to pick your bones clean kangaroo unsettled times need to plan ahead well they're, they're heading towards poverty so that's the overarching they're vultures but you know what? Vultures aren't all bad. I mean, in, in ancient Egypt, vultures also were the protectors of the pharaohs. So that should maybe that has something to do with it. Bridge successfully overcoming a problem. Problem. Congratulations, because you elevated. Okay? They didn't cut a two-faced friend. Bag. Something important such as a new job or a raise. Congratulations. They, this is what they wanted, and they manipulated. Financial gain usually coming from something you did in the past. Now, yesterday I posted, oh, I didn't post, I was about to post, a picture of Delphinus, the Delphinus, I think it's what it's called, constellation, because I kept popping up in my head for some reason. Um, look it up. Maybe that might have something to do with what you're going through. It might resonate with you. So, grapes, time to go out and have some fun. Your birthday could be in August. Somebody else's birthday could be in August or something's going to happen. Axe, forces working against you. Be careful, okay? People are working against you. Bird perched, waiting for news, package or letter. I'm, I'm picking up somebody was manipulating your, your your correspondence, whether it's letters or messaging or phone calls, okay? Ant, work achievement success. Broken wishbone, wish will not be granted. Rooster, an arrogant, boastful person you should not cross. Bread period of prosperity and abundance. So somebody made some money off of you or elevated somewhat against your, you know, working against you, but now it's, it's eh, the rooster's coming home to roost. <laughs> Ten, it was only temporary, temporary situation, what I tell you. So Arrow, you're on the right path regarding some aspect of your life and happiness and well-being is for you. The sun is the happiest card in the deck in tarot, so congratulations. You're going to be happy. Even though these people were playing in your energy, even though they said and did things that were really low, don't worry. You're being watched over. You're coming into a windfall. Okay? That's all I got to say. Whether through a lottery win, a job, um, an inheritance, life insurance, I don't know, savings that you didn't know you had, I don't know. Selling a home that, you know, the somebody left you. I don't know. It could be anything. It could be a, a lawsuit. So it's Papalotal Purification Message 7. Oh, Vulture and Manipulation. I'm flashing on maybe somebody sent you a letter or a card or something in the mail. They could have had something on it. Always purify and cleanse. No matter what, okay? If you're you're doubting, if it's something that somebody, if you're dealing with somebody that you don't normally deal with or they don't normally send you things in the mail, cleanse it, okay? Oh, what's this? Oh, there's, it's an Easter card? What do you mean? Is the card wishing me a happy Easter? You know what I mean? Meanwhile, they live down five minutes down the road or something like that, or they never even sent you a Christmas card or a birthday card. All of a sudden, you get it in the mail. Yeah, question that one. You ain't stupid. Yeah, see right through their bullshit, and their machinations, their manipulations. They want to pick your bones clean, that's what it is. They're scavengers, these people, okay? They didn't hunt down these animals. That, that's what vultures do. They don't hunt them down. They don't go in for the kill. They wait till an animal passes by one way or another, and then they, they swoop in, right? They're scavengers. So whatever this is, it didn't belong to them. They were just waiting for you to go down so they could swoop in. 
pick your bones clean. Don't think so. But then again, like I said, vultures were um, protectors of the pharaohs. And maybe on the other side, on the other side, right? I don't know. Where are we going with this message, please? Purification message seven. Man manipulation of vulture spirit. That's a message here for the collective, please. <laughs> oh boy. Nine of Cups. These two are playing nicely, getting along. It looks like this one, she's just watching these two. She, uh, I'm, I'm picking up the air of somebody that feels that they're above these two. Eating all the cookies here. She's not sharing it. These two share. These, This one doesn't share. Somebody's very selfish here. Okay. They want what you have. Their eyes are bigger than her tummy. Yeah. So somebody's contemplating, praying, strategizing, healing. Uh, they need to put something to rest, possibly. Um, somebody's healing some. There's transitions here. There's three butterflies. But there's also three swords above this person that's armored up. They're trying to protect themselves. They're heartbroken. They're getting intrusive thoughts because they've been sitting on the truth for a long time here. These two don't look too happy either. This one looks mad. This one looks sad. Maybe they did spell work and now they're healing, trying to heal from it. Or you're healthy. You're too healthy for them. They don't like it. I don't know. Take a supplies. Okay. Yeah, you're healthy. I'm just saying they have to bring they have to bring balance to a situation. You could be an earth angel as well. Okay, you're very moderate in everything you do. You transmuted this shit, right? You're quite healthy. You put it to rest. You're telling them to put it to rest. Let's say maybe they can't. Um, sorry about the background noise. Alchemize what they put out. Now they want to reconcile with you. And you have to get let it go. You gotta let it go. Why am I picking up that song from um, Megan um, Trainer? My name is No. My sign is No. What a hot. Uh... Oh, what's that song? Oh, I have to remember. Somebody's letting go, giving up. They're angry. They let go of, a, of money. They let go of an opportunity. They let go of some, some. They stole money. So they got let go. They have to balance something out. They wasted a lot of money. This was a bad investment. So they could have spent a lot of money on spell work. And they lost a lot of money to it. They should have invested this money elsewhere. You get what you give here, okay? With spell work. Most, most importantly, with spell work. You get what you give. What you put out is what you get back. But by X amount. It depends on what the divine wants to get, how, how much, right? It could be eight of, eight of Pentacles that didn't work in reverse, right? It could also be a Six of Pentacles. Uh, they're unstable right now. They're losing money. They have to relocate. They, yeah, oh boy, look at High Priestess in reverse. Wasn't worth the why. Wasn't worth the money, was it? Right? All the spell work, High Priestess in reverse. That was, uh, they could have lost their intuition if they had any. Um, unwise counsel. So they were dealing with a practitioner that wasn't very wise. They possibly just took their money. And lied to them. So their bones got picked clean. I don't know. Yeah. Because they made a lot of money off this uh, this, this, this spell casting. Take it for what it is. The secrets are coming out now. Some, one way or another. <clears throat> they have to fix this. They have to balance something out. They want healing now. Now they're sorry. I don't know. It's been going on for a long time. You let Because you let these people go. They didn't think you were as Protected as you were. They're certainly not protected. This is justice coming in here. Secrets are coming out. This is justice. Okay, they're getting karma. And they're fighting over a baby or something like this. They're fighting over a birthright. I just heard. Okay. It could be this inheritance or life insurance. It could be siblings fighting. They were reckless, careless, foolish. They took unnecessary risks. There will be no new beginnings. Okay, they, they, they were very naive with what they were doing. Trying to sacrifice. Oh, I hope it's not a young one. You dirty MFers. I hope not. These people, look, the truth is coming out. These people are all, they, this is what they wanted for you. A lynch bob after you. They could have accused you of doing this, but it was them. They didn't want to let this go. They're struggling. They can't overcome. Okay? This foolish, foolish, foolish. People are coming after them. Maybe everybody around them was taking on some losses because of them. Because of the spell work backfiring. You know what I mean? And they turned around and said it was you. Nah, it was them. Okay? Fool in reverse. You don't need to touch magic. Yeah, something happened very quickly. 
People who have pubs are a player energy as well. They, they, they knee jerk reactions. They didn't think before they acted. And it, look at this. It could be an internal disruption. They're taking some sort of action to avoid this. And they're gold diggers and cloud chasers. They wanted you to lose your destiny. They're, that's something they can't handle. I mean, they can't do. I mean, this is not their jurisdiction, let's say, okay? None of it is. So, this their crown chakra is blown. Maybe they, you're in their crown chakra. They, at one point, that, okay, thank you. There's so much coming in right now. And by the way, it's Mercury retrograde, so pardon me for tripping over my words. Somebody did something, they didn't think about it, okay? They thought they couldn't get burnt. They were armored up. See the salamanders on this, um jersey or whatever you call it that's covering up this person that indicates they didn't think they could get burnt but look at this this tower this is ruin they were coming after you they wanted to ruin your crown chakra your connection with yeah with source this was a coven or a group okay they're not celebrating right now i don't think yeah it's not. they wanted you left out on the cold feeling sorry for yourself but i think this group and or this person is they got kicked out of this group coven secret society cult whatever this is okay it's a lot of gossip going going around here. Somebody's trying to avoid it. Uh, yes, they're trying to protect themselves. There you go. Yeah, they're thinking about apologizing. Something to do with a child. Somebody's innocent. They want you to know they're innocent. They had nothing to do with this. This other people. I don't know. They knew about it. Why didn't they warn you? Why didn't they, you know, do something about it? Why didn't they say, tell this person to F off? You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Somebody was smug, full of themselves, selfish, and know it all and show off. That's why. Okay. They've lost their position, whatever position this is. This is not wish fulfillment. Okay. They were drinking a lot, hidden addictions. They're all holding it close to their chest. Maybe they were under the um, influence while they were doing this work. Wow. They're trying to affect your job. You've mastered something. You could be, this could be self-mastery, your, your success. They want to affect your, your work or something. Um, they were copying or trying to copy your work. People are seeing it for what it is here. Seven of Cups in reverse. All the all that glitter and gold is, is, I mean, all that glitter isn't gold, right? There's no more confusion here. This were, this was nothing but illusions. They, they said they were a master of what they did. They are not. They're running out of options. They don't have a choice here. The truth is out. Moon in reverse. They got to face their fears or whatever this is, okay? They're trying to block this truth from getting out. They're trying to block something. They have no authority, no growth, no expansion, no new beginnings, no passion. I don't know. It's a hard one. They could have bri uh, bragged that they had authority, spiritual authority. Yeah, no. They're being blocked here. They're trying to block this truth from coming out and or... Yeah, the truth is you're stable and secure. Single, uh, well, not single. Um... You know your value and your, and your worth. You, you act with integrity, loyalty, and honesty. This could be a wife card. doesn't have to be. It could be a male in this energy. But you are very gracious and generous with this person or persons. You're working on your pentacles. You're very um, stable and secure, successful. You're abundant. You're independent. You go your own way type of thing. You, you're not codependent. And this was a partnership and or a relationship you had at one point with a soulmate. Or this is them. They wanted to keep. Maybe this they were coming after your eyes, seeing through the illusions here. You saw through the illusions. It could be an ex or siblings. You parted ways with these people. You're not toxic, okay? You detached from this person or persons or somebody in their life. It could be a wife that wants to detach from them. They don't want to be around it. Somebody's refusing to move on. Um... They've invested so much in this, I want to say, chicanery. Oh boy, I haven't heard that in a long time. They don't want to move on from this. Somebody's got to take on the loss, so somebody's got to take on the loss. Somebody wants to detach from this, don't want to be around. Yeah, it could be children or something. Um, you're innocent. People are finding out that you're innocent. You're sweet and kind. You have nothing to do with all of this. The people, the, whoever this was, was shit-talking you. Could be siblings, could be somebody from your past, could be children, could be parents, could be cousins, could be anybody. So the ancestors are walking. Maybe this is generation after generation that's been going on. And you're the first one to break the cycle here because you broke free. Devil in reverse. You're not continuing this um, 
this is for your children and their children, right? Anti descendants or your descendants. Is that the word? Yeah. So you healed your own heart. You're, you have no burden. So you removed all obstacles. You're not bound. You're not bound by their whatever it is that's binding them. Um, you're free. You're free of it. You've healed your own heart. This is a blessing in disguise for some reason. It could be somebody in your past wanting to come forth and ask for forgiveness as well. They want to help take those swords out of your heart. But I think you've already managed it. Thank you. You don't need any help, especially from them. Yeah. This is uh, faded and destiny here. This is divine timing as well. Though that will's turning in your favor and they're trying to block it. They were gold diggers and cloud chasers and they're being blocked. Yeah, this is a backfire. They're trying to block a backfire. Because you're still fortunate right here. Okay, you're still covered by the universe. They're not. This is bad news. They're grieving and regretting here. Okay, what they've done. They're looking down at what they've lost and what they could have had. I could have, been, I could have this. Listen, I'm picking up. This could be a life insurance or an inheritance or some family money or something. They could have had what you have right now. But they they refused. They wanted it all. They, they, they were willing to sacrifice you for temporary things and people. that Things that don't matter. And I keep, whenever I see this card, I see the, the stream coming down, right? So shit trickles down from the top. So whomever is at the top, it, it's taking everybody else along with them. This person could have been at the head of the family, could have been your spouse, could have been anybody. They didn't care about true connections here. And they put you last all the time. Yes, end of the collaboration, false contract, ending with a third, ending it with a third party. Um, uncooperative, no one's cooperating with this person, they're left alone they, yeah, it's over lessons have been learned, whether they want to learn them or not they're going to learn them, you're divinely protected from this black magic, okay somebody was very jealous jelly belly okay, they're very jealous, okay they're very abusive um, promiscuous possibly they're certainly not in independent okay they use sexual wiles to get their way. It could, it could be that. Or it could just be somebody that's very jealous of you and angry. It could be something. It's not simple, but you know what I mean. It, it, it could run the whole gamut. Somebody playing with black magic, blah, 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 accusing you online maybe. But nobody wants to participate in this anymore. Okay? Because they know the truth. They want protection. That's what it is. Yep. Yeah. This is heartless and cruel and cold. No emotional fulfillment or happiness. They're not getting emotional support either. This person's thirsty. They just drain people. They don't want you having new love, true love, self-love, possibly. They don't love themselves. But you're standing in your power here. You are nurturing and kind, see? You're watching out for the next generation, I think. And you're in your power. You hold the rod. You have power here, okay? The divine is giving you authority. You're bold. You're fierce. You're a warrior. You're very confident and a leader. And you're not afraid. You have no fear. And I see that sunflower. It's in reverse here, but um, you might seem very intimidating on the outside, but you're, you're so loving and kind and nurturing when people get to know you. And you have that basket of plenty here. You have plenty of love to go around and nurturing. And you don't mind giving out that nurturing and love, you know, that, that attention. And they don't want this. They didn't accept it, maybe. They didn't want it. They poured that cup of love out. Oh, well. They could have had it all. Yeah, balanced here. You got to balance something out. You were so very generous with these people. And they scapegoated you. This was not an equal give and take. It could be a family or a group. They're not happy now. They're not celebrating because you're balanced. Where's this going to send this way, please? It's a, it's a quick one, I feel. The uh, energies are disjointed. I mean, with the transits, yeah. Somebody's not happy. They might be, they're stuck. Uh, this is self-imposed. They're stuck in their head. They're trapped within the situation. There's, they could be going to jail or they're restricted. The family's restricting them. Or the family could be going to jail or this group, whatever this is, okay? They, there's too many obstacles to overcome. The worst has happened. This is a nightmare. They're bound to stinky. They're going to jail. They're bound to whatever it is they've done. They're being hounded and, hounded and haunted by whatever they've conjured up here. They're bound to the devil. What can I say? They are praying that they get away from this. You're out in the public eye. 
you're a healer. Maybe they're going to come towards you and ask you to help them heal from this. They are restricted, maybe restricted from seeing you. You don't want to see them. This could be a, a parent and a child. It's a spirit taking you to a happier place, plucking you out of broth waters, bringing you into calm waters to heal. So you could be a healer of some sort, and they know you can help, help them heal. Look at this. Oh, I just realized this. She's healing. She's pouring the water, the healing waters, you know, on dry land and back into the water, blah, blah, blah. This guy's walking right away with a bag full of loot. They're looking at you like, oh, they'll cure me. No, they don't. They want to distill your money, your prosperity, your divinity, possibly. You're on your north node, though, and you're divinely protected. And they thought they could steal from you. Maybe your energy, your aura, whatever this is. Wow. You're, you're standing your ground. You're very divinely protected. They wanted people to come after you. Now the people are coming after them. You could be on the run right now. Because something's going to be made public. I don't know. Take it as supplies. I'm picturing Frankenstein, right? Yeah. Parting ways with karmics. Uh, there's a one-sided deal or there's a false contract. It, again, it was a one-sided deal. Poor decisions. They could have chose a karmic over you if it's a partner and or just a, a friend or a family member. Poor decisions. There's consequences. They're all fighting amongst each other. It's competition, conflict, fighting, drama, jealousies, chaos, and rivalry. It's a gang of people. Parting ways with this people here. Somebody is... Um, Five of Pentacles in reverse. This is spiritual jail. This is financial ruin. They're all ruined, maybe, or they want to come back in from out of the cold. They're being investigated, or you're shining a light on something, or somebody's pulled themselves out of poverty, whether this is you or someone else. They want to know how you did it, how you bossed up, took back your power. Male or female doesn't matter. Could be invest being investigated here. They tried to slow down your money. At a turtle's pace or tortoise pace. Yeah, you know your value and your worth. Somebody wants to seize an opportunity with you. You seized or somebody seized an opportunity to expo um, to expose these people. This is finan uh, financial. This is um, public humiliation. They, were, they had a lot to hide here. Somebody didn't want to change. They didn't want to change the status quo. Uh, this is a, hard, a harsh and painful end for somebody. This is a very permanent ending. Uh, they didn't want to change. Oh, God has a way of making you change for the better, whether you like it or not. Whether it's through jail, rehab, loss of everything you coveted, um, whatever this is, illness. There's different ways. God has different ways of making you see the light. Yeah, speaking the truth. This could be Law and Order or it's Archangel Michael, just as the sirens went off. Somebody abandoned a baby. Um, they abandoned you, maybe, with this sword. It could be a child that knows the truth and the whole matter. Somebody's coming back to court, or they're getting arrested here. They got caught. They have to complain. There we go. They could have done something to a child, or they made up a story about you sacrificing children to try to get people to come after you and harm you. They set you up. This is a um, scapegoat. They scapegoated you to practitioners. Covens, your, your, I don't know, community, your family. They wanted you hurt because you're stable and secure. You're single, abundant, independent, uh, self-sufficient, stable, and secure. Or if this has something to do with a large amount of money, they wanted it all for themselves. Truth and clarity. There we go. They're being exposed. This is the cops coming through. So this is authority, but it's also victory. This is the universally driven. This reminds me of a cop car. Two people are going to be sitting in the back of a cop car. And everybody's going to be cheering this on. It's going to be a, in public view. Okay? Somebody coming in. Maybe you'll see it on the news. Right? <laughs> Somebody's trying to block this from happening. Um, it could have been a fight. They wanted to you know, do something to you physically. They got caught before they came towards you. You know, they were plotting and planning. Take it as a play. See how they're tied and they're being paraded through town. Yeah, this is wanting. This is very chaotic energy. Damn, this is a, a doppelganger wanting to be you. Uh, maybe they did something. Yeah, they were plotting and planning against you, and they lied. Wow, this, this is a love bomber. They were doing magic. They were having casual hookups with everybody. It's a scammer over a long period of time, and they wanted everybody to see this as you online 
I think that everybody sees it's them. Because you're speaking your truth too, too. Seeing the truth. Coming out of denial. Yep. Online. They're, they're being investigated. They, they were under surveillance. This is a poser and a player. Somebody that's a, not a leader. This is a, a follower. It's all ego and arrogance. Um, they're angry. They want power and control, but they can't control themselves. Yep. Somebody's, somebody's very balanced here. Making a head over heart decision. They thought, they, what, you know what? They thought the people they were dealing with or the community were sheep. Follow the leader. Playing games. But somebody, ha <laughs> these people aren't sheep. They see it for what it is. They have a higher perspective. They're under divine judgment. This is awareness. Now they want to be saved. Ah, the angels have turned their backs on them. Sorry, it's, the energy is a little all over the place because of the the eclipses, the full moon. Transits were Mercury right now, retrograde. Uh, it's papilotal purification. So cleanse, cleanse, cleanse your home, yourself, your car. Tiamat, control. You, you've remained in control the whole time. They wanted to control you, control this group of people with magic, and they blamed you for doing magic on them. It's a definite fuck now, okay? Liar, liar, pants on fire. You could work in this community, or they put a lot of work in, but justice is here, Okay. They committed a miscarriage of justice, an injustice, an imbalance towards you. It was amoral or criminal. Yeah, somebody's getting a message here. This is universally driven. This is victory. You've overcome quite a lot. You're moving forward. You don't need these people in your life. They've been, they were vultures, okay? There's somebody's going through, they wanted you to be depressed, anxious, worried that somebody's against you so you could maybe look crazy. This might be the inheritance thing. And or there, this is them, okay? They, they were trying to pick your bones clean, but you were protected. You might be from a pharaonic, you know, line, lineage. Kangaroo, unsettled times, need to plan ahead. They're going to have to plan ahead. They wanted you to carry them or other people to carry them. This could be a child or something to do. Somebody could be pregnant. I don't know. Manipulation, integrity. They wanted to see your integrity fall. Maybe they know that you're a person with great integrity, honor, and honor. You do the, the noble thing. They wanted to see you fall. Maybe they bet on it. You know what I mean? I bet you my magic can work over your magic. You're sick. Whoever you are, you're sick. How do you like these apples? It's all turned back on you. Oh, boy. Now that it's coming out in the, in the, in the spotlight, how would you feel if everybody laughed at you? Hmm? But this is true. What, what's being said and seen about you is the truth. It's not manipulation. So, how's it feel? Not nice. I, I'm sure it doesn't feel nice. That's a lesson. Do, don't do unto others what you don't want done unto you, okay? So where are we going with this, please, Spirit? What's the final message here for the collective? 15, devil energy, codependency, addictions, obsessions. Damn. They're bound to the devil. Four. Somebody bossed up to back their power. This could be in the reverse, too. It was corruption, abuse of power, abuse of authority. You saw through the illusions and broke free. You detached. You took back your power. And or this is somebody that's a very corrupt leader or father or boss. Uh, 36, there's an investigation. Okay. They wanted you in this, in this, yeah, in this uh, cemetery. It could be doing graveyard, using graveyard dirt. You are very protected here, okay? Under the umbrella and canopy of the divine, the angels have been watching over you. You're going to get your flowers here. Okay, you are. And what they, again, it's the emperor. It could be corruption. They're crying now. Somebody wanted power and control so very badly. And if in this, in this card, it's somebody very young. They have to elevate, mature yet. You know what I mean? They can't just demand or command authority. You grow into it. Maybe it's just a father and a child. I don't know. Take it as a play. So we're going to read what this is. I want my father's place or my mother's place. Whatever this is. Baby steps. Learn. Elevate. Autumn virtuoso. Releasing ties, creativity, achievement. Creativity is an important part of our lives. When our creativity is stifled, we fail to thrive and we lack true purpose. If you're feeling overwhelmed with mundane tasks, it's time to step back and take a moment to reflect on what you really want. There's a sense of exhaustion as you try too hard to please others. It's time to nurture your needs. So you place other people ahead of you. It's time to start that, okay? You come first. You can't pour from an empty cup. 
Self-love first, okay? Uh, the ivy in this card represents clinging to old habits which no longer serve you. Yeah. Okay. It's time to let go of negative energy. I agree. Your creative soul and whatever your skills or desires may be, you need to follow your heart and seek what makes you happy. Symbolically, violins represent the ability to achieve more. Start looking for a new and ambitious path. You will feel a huge sense of relief when you discover what destiny has in store for you. So if you follow other people's suggestions, you're following their path that they think you should follow. It's not your path, though. Just some know-it-all wanting to keep you small. Do you understand what I'm saying? Follow your heart. Uh, Amarath Long Game. She's been coming up a lot lately. Same with this one came up yesterday. And I do shuffle. Martyrdom, regret, past mistakes. Oh boy, regret. We've had a few, haven't we? You may feel after a long personal journey that you've had to make sacrifices in order to change things. Although your journey has been long and at times difficult, life often works out for the best even though you may be questioning the motives of others and that this has all been in vain. It's not. You're learning. You're elevating. Okay? There, are, there is a sense you may be feeling unfocused, lost, unloved, and uncertain of which path you should now take. The stability of what you once were familiar with will now change. And although you may feel fearless of the changes ahead, moving forward can only be a good thing. This is a time of no regrets, as looking back serves no purpose. Use the negative aspects of past experience as your greatest lessons and gain strength from this. It's said life never throws us more than we can handle, and it is so true. This is your time to show the world what you are truly made of. So 36, we have winter rebirth, confidence, ability, multitasking. The ability to look and feel confident when there's chaos around you is quite an art. So you made things look great. You handled it with grace. You made people think that you weren't suffering, that you didn't go through hard times, but you did. You were just more resourceful. And I don't think it comes from ego. I think it's just, you know, you went with the flow. You know, you, you trusted in God and you, you, you said to yourself, you know, I can't, I can't bemoan this. I can't change this. It is what it is. I can work through it though or around it, however way God wants me to, right? Challenges have made you stronger and you can hold your head high and be proud of what you, what you have achieved. You have an air of confidence about you. Others can also see this and are watching you blossom into the person you wish to be. You're protected and connected to your higher self, a beautiful gift, learning to use this wisely and watch life expand beautifully. There are messages all around you. Open your eyes to synchronicities. Spirit are talking to you and showing you the way. And they always will. And you're never alone. Let's end this with the angels, please. Because the angels, your spirit guides, your guardian angels, your ancestors, the divine, they're all trying to message you. The ascended masters, they're guiding you. Just call on them. You have nothing to lose and everything to gain. Call on Archangel Michael. Test him out. If you lose something, you know you just had it in your hand. You can't find it. Test him out. Ask him. Call Archangel Michael to help you find it. The minute you say it out of your mouth, it's, you'll find it. Your eyes will fall on it. Just to show you Archangel Michael's all around. Always around you. Okay? Start off with small little things like that if you're unsure. Okay? Angels, how are we ending this, please? Uma Bell. We have the Ace of Swords, Truth and Clarity. So the Spirit saying, true. What I just said was true. Okay? The Sword of Truth. That belongs to Archangel Michael, doesn't it? Affinity and Friendship. God above all names elevated. 61. So this is universally driven. You're moving forward. You're overcoming. You're catching. You're getting into your groove, let's say. It's radical acceptance. Bringing back balance to your life and taking accountability for you, for your actions, for your words. Okay? Let's stop shifting the blame. Like, okay, yeah, shit. I, 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 everything that happens in our life, it comes into our life because we allow it in one way or another. Not willingly, not knowingly, but maybe you got some red flags and you ignored it. I'm not putting the blame on you. I just want you to understand we all play a role, me included. Okay? So this is a eye opener. God above all named at names elevated, affinity and friendship, obtain the friendship of anyone. So you might be coming into a new friend circle, which is great. Ten of Swords, oh, that's a friend circle that did you in here. Ten of Swords, it's um, betrayal. Louis, uh, 17, but you were really protected here, okay? They didn't want your wishes coming true. They didn't know you were on your north node, possibly. All eyes were on you. They were spying on you. But this is also the throne angels. They see everything, and they're mighty warriors. They defend and protect the throne of God. Destroying angels, maybe. 
So you could be a person that's highly intuitive. You see things that people... I'm picking up you have a rare gift. You see things. <laughs> well, revelation protects from sadness, gives revelations and dreams. Game of Thrones. <laughs> Funko, Funko, Funko. So this is a harsh and painful end for somebody. But uh, on the bright side, the, the worst is over. You're, you're going to be able to move on from this and heal, recover, recru regroup, re you know, regain what it was lost maybe. Or maybe not. Maybe it wasn't for you. Maybe you just you, you belong somewhere else with something else. You know what I mean? Uh, three cups. This could be a, a reconciliation. A, uh, you could be celebrating or this is a group or you're on your path here. 22 is a master number. It could be a secret society or a cult that did this or were involved. And I'm not saying they're all shady. I'm saying there's bad apples everywhere you go. Fame and renown, the right hand of God. You're going to be celebrating. Influences, commerce, voyages, and great discoveries. So you're going to be moving. You're going to be celebrating. That tower. This is a shift. It's, it's The tower is here. It's universally driven, okay? It's going to happen quick. It's going to be sudden. It's to redirect you where you need to go. Something was built on a false foundation a house on salt and sand the fire of god disruption warns of disasters aids in transformation this is going to help you redirect you like i said well you might like like what's going on but it's for your your betterment okay king of pentacles you got to stay stable that's the the advice is stay stable stay grounded this could be you're dealing with a husband it doesn't have to be it could be a female in this energy this is success okay uh, abundance um Stable and secure. The adored God, 34, moving forward, overcoming, traveling, universally driven, victory. Obedience causes harmony and peace, calms anger in anyone. So stay grounded. Three of swords. Because, yeah, somebody wanted to break their, your heart. This is heartbreaking a situation. Could be a third party involved. Three of swords. Um, or you healed your own heart. Could be in the reverse. It's a blessing in disguise. You're going to see this was a blessing in disguise. 39, they tried to sacrifice you. You made sacrifices for these people. They could be getting arrested. It's illumination. They're being exposed. You let go and you let God. You surrendered this. They're acting like martyrs. Now they want to co cooperate or compromise with you. They were wasting your time. They're time waster as well. So I don't know. It could be any of these things. Some one end or none. You overcame. They can't. You took that sword out of that stone. Not everybody could do that. So you overcame. You're going, yeah, you see her hand here? Was that, it was that simple. It was that easy. <laughs> love and submission cures illness, influences paternal love, and gives long life. Congratulations. Ten of Wands. <sighs> Somebody's, you're putting down these burdens, okay? You're, you're starting a new cycle. They're burdened now. They're stressed. They were trying to, they had a point to prove. Or maybe you proved your point. You are crowned, Right? They wanted your crown. You're, you do have a connection with Source. Take it for what it is. Uh, Nanael, 53. You have integrity, loyalty, and honesty. You have strength and courage. And you have the might of God behind you. Power and control. And that's what they wanted. They wanted to shut you down. They wanted your crown chakra. God humiliating the proud. Spiritual communication influences religious men, teachers, and men of law. Yep, and that's what they were doing to you, all right, and doing spell work and doing all kinds of things against you to, to get this. Well, uh, the divine's not going to allow that. And what um, karmic world, <laughs> obviously it's a karmic world of theirs, do you think that God's going to allow that to happen? He's not. I hope this helps. I'm sending you a great deal of love, lots of healing. Congratulations, whoever this is. And until next time, take care.